the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, we're going to help this noob reach second C using the gravity food. But before that, guys, I've created a Twitter account for this channel, so please do follow for future announcements and giveaways. And also, guys, to show your support, you can use the star code GamerNome when buying your Robux. Okay, so let's start by eating this gravity fruit. There you go. For our first skill, we have the gravity push Z skill. So we're gonna start by defeating the bandits. Okay, so we're gonna lure five. There you go, two, three, four, and five. And we're gonna use our gravity push. Okay, to defeat them. There you go. The goal here is to reach level 10. Okay, level 10. So when we reach level 10, we are now ready to move on to our next island, which is the jungle. Okay, so here, guys, we're gonna start with the monkeys. Okay, there you go. You need to defeat six. Just lure three at a time. Just a reminder, you need to use your gravity push to defeat your enemies to increase your mastery or to level up your mastery. Okay, with just one quest, by defeating six, your level will be 14. There you go, one more time and you will reach level 17. The requirement for the gorilla quest actually is level 15. So as soon as you reach that level, you can start the quest here. So here you go, you need to defeat eight, lure four at a time, defeat them, do it twice to finish one quest. And with just one quest, you will reach level 20, meaning you can start your Gorilla King quest and this monster is the mini boss in this island. So it's easy to defeat, just stay in a high ground, use your gravity push to avoid getting damage. The goal in this island is to reach level 30, there you go, and after that you can now proceed to your next island. And that island is the pirate village. So we're here, we're gonna start with the pirates, you need to defeat 8, same with the gorillas, just lure 4, there you go, defeat them. Two, three, four, okay, five. Okay, you need to do it twice to level up. The goal here is to reach level 40. And at 40, you can start the brute quest. There you go. You need to defeat 10, so you need to lure five at a time. So with that, you just need to do it twice. The goal here is to reach level 75. But at level 55, you can start defeating Bobby the clown, he's the mini boss in this island. There you go. You guys just dodge this skill and everything will be fine. Okay? The goal here is to reach level 60. You can go back with the brutes to finish the quest if ever the clown hasn't respawned yet. So stat check 45 melee, 41 defense, 94 blocks fruit. Now we are ready to move on to our next island, the desert. So here we're gonna start with the desert bandits. Remember the pirates, you need to defeat 8, right? Same here, lure 4 at a time. Defeat those 4, there you go. Do it twice to level up. So the goal here is to reach level 75. But before we reach that, we will be unlocking a new skill. And that skill is the boulder fly. There you go, I'm gonna show it to you, don't worry. There you go, so not the fastest one, but as long as you can travel with it, no need to buy a boat. So guys, do you prefer using this or both? Comment it on the comment section. But now, we're gonna start with the desert officers. So you can lure 4 at a time for more experience, but 3 will do. Just defeat them. Okay, do it twice to level up. So the goal here is to reach level 105. Before we move on to our next island, stat check 60 melee, defense 195, blocks fruit. Okay, so now moving on to our next island, we have the frozen village in this cave. Buy the Gepo for 10,000, buy the Buso for 25,000, and buy the Soru for 100,000, right? Now guys, why 105? So we can defeat Yeti. Yeti is the mini boss in this island. There you go, just create distance, use your gravity push, everything will be fine. Next up, Snow Bandits. You just need to lure 5 at a time. Nice, five. You need to defeat 7, right? After defeating 5, it's up to you if you want to lure 2 or 5. There you go. The goal here is to reach level 130. And after that, stat check, 78 mil defense, 234 blocks fruit. Okay, so here is our next island, the Marine Fortress. So we're just gonna defeat the Vice Admiral here until we reach level 150, guys. Just do server hop. So how do you defeat him? Use your gravity push, dodge that skill, and everything will be fine. 
Okay, there you go. Again, guys, before you reach 150, we will be unlocking again another skill, and that is the Gravity Obeisance. There you go, guys. This is my favorite skill of the Gravity Fruit. Okay, so now, guys, again, our goal here is to reach level 150. And when you reach that, we are ready to move on to our next island. Okay, for our next island, we have the Skylands. So in this island, we're gonna start with the Sky Bandits. Again, you need to defeat seven, right? So there are four here. Just need to lure four at a time. There you go, defeat them. Wait for them to spawn. And defeat again four, or just three if you want, that's enough. The goal here is to reach level 175. And when you reach that level, we are now ready to defeat the Dark Masters. Again, you need to defeat 8. They're located here. So you just need to lure 4. 1, 2, 3, and 4. Defeat them. You're gonna need to do it twice to level up. And the goal in this island is to reach level 225. So before we move on to our next island, stat check. 110 melee defense, 455 blocks fruit. For our next island, we have the Coliseum. So here we're gonna start with the Toga Warriors. A quest will ask you to defeat seven Toga Warriors. So, so what I do here is I lure four at a time. There you go, defeat four. And after that, defeat three or four again to level up. So the goal here is to reach level 275. And after that, you can now start your quest with the Gladiators. So you need to defeat eight. So lure four at a time. One, two, three, and Four, there you go, defeat them. Do it twice to level up. So guys, at level 250, you can start grinding here in the prison. Remember that. We have three mini bosses here. The swan. There you go. The other one is the warden. And the other one is the chief warden. So it really depends to you if you want to do server hop here until you reach level 300 or finish your grinding with the gladiators. Stat check, 152 melee defense, 596 blocks food. Okay, for our next island, we have the Magma Village. So here, we're gonna start with the military soldiers. You need to defeat 9, right? So you just lure 5 here. Yes, you can lure all 5. Just make sure to lure them in the bridge. There you go. Goal here is to reach level 330. But before that, guys, we will be unlocking our fourth skill. And that skill is the Meteor Pitch. So I'm gonna show you the meter pitch again at level I mastery 200. There you go. Okay. So again, guys, at level 330, we can now start defeating the military spies. So there you go, eight, right? So here you just get a lure four. One, two, three, and four. There you go. Defeat them twice to finish one quest. So the goal here in this island is to reach level 375. At 350, you can start defeating the Magma Admiral to make leveling up faster. Again, you can server hop to make things faster here. There you go. Okay, so stat check. 164 melee and defense. 706 blocks fruit. Next island would be the Underwater City. So there you go. So here, we're gonna start with the Fishman Warriors. So you can lure 7 at a time, to be honest. If you want more experience, go. Go for 7. But what I did here is lure 4 at a time. Do it, doing it twice to finish one quest. Anyways, guys, we're gonna level up here with the Fishman Warriors until you reach level 450. But to make things faster, we will start defeating the Fishman Lord. There you go, at 425. Okay? Just to make things faster. Gamer Nom, any tips? After every skill, just dodge. There you go. Until he uses his skill, and then attack him. And that's it. Okay? So for our next island, actually we've been through this island, the Skylands, but we will just go step higher. We're gonna defeat God's Guard, so you can lure 6 at a time to be honest. There you go. Defeat 6, wait for them to spawn and defeat 6 again for faster leveling up. The goal here is to reach level 525 guys. Why? Because it's so fast to level up here. There you go, again 525 and after that, you can go to the upper yard. Oh, I almost forgot you can level up with the Whisper at level 500. So just touch his cannon. So use your skill. Dodge to the side as soon as possible to dodge his skill. There you go, the cannon and use your skill and that will be it. It's very easy to defeat as long as you know how to dodge. 
Next up, the Royal Squads. Again, we're gonna skip the Shandas. So here you go, lure 4 at a time. 4 is enough, do it twice. So level up. Again, if you want, you can lure 5 at a time. Go. The goal here is to reach level 575. And when you reach that level, you can start defeating the mini boss in this island. And that boss is the Thunder God. Okay, so again, same with the other bosses. After every skill, you dodge. Okay, that's it. But make sure that you cycle all your skills so that its HP will not regenerate. Okay, there you go. There you go, we've dodged it. Now, time to use our skill. So, okay, so at 576, you can now defeat the Royal Soldiers if you want. But it's harder, guys. I always get hit by these mobs. So if you want, you can go back to the Royal Squads. But the goal in this island is to reach level 625. Okay? Again, 625. So if ever you have a chance to defeat the Thunder God, go back to him. If you want to focus on him, do server hop. As long as you reach 625. Okay. We're about to reach that level now. There you go. Stat check. 406 melee, 403 defense, 1066 block food. So for our final grinding island, we have the Fountain City. So here, we're gonna start and end with the galley pirates. So you need to defeat eight, right? So lure four at a time. One, two, three, and four. Defeat them. There you go. Do it twice to level up. The goal here is to reach level 700. And by the way, you can start defeating Cyborg when you reach level 675. So is it hard to defeat? Just do our technique, the hit and run. So here go, Cyborg. But before that, we've unlocked our last skill, the Meteor's Rain. So we'll just make it rain with Meteors and that's it for the skill. There you go. So guys, every time you use the skill, just dodge, okay? That's it. That's our technique for almost all the bosses. There you go, dodge. Guys, you need to dodge that skill of him. The gun or multiple cannon shots, I don't know the name. Because that can really burst you. Okay, there you go. So after you defeat him, a quest will emerge. You need to go to the prison immediately. Actually, not immediately, but before we go on to that island, here is the stats 500 mil defense, 1100 blocks. Now heading to the prison, there you go. Talk to the military detective. He will give you a key, okay? And you will use the, that key to open the door in the cave in the frozen village. There you go. Open it. Defeat the ice admiral. There you go. It's easy to defeat. Don't worry. Again, same strategy. Hit and run. Oops. Okay, there you go. So next up, you will go back to the prison. And the military detective will then ask you to go to the middle town and locate his friend, the experienced pirate. And that pirate will send you to the second scene. Okay, guys. So that will be it for this video. For requests and recommendations, comment it on the comment section. Again, to so all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom. And Gamer Nom out.